Swan Bay is a Ramsar wetland. I think it's important to protect because of all the pebble crabs and swans and all the other birds in their natural habitat for all the other animals. I'm Angie Poole. I'm the Coastal Program Leader for the Bellarine Catchment Network. We work towards delivering environmental programs to get everyone engaged in caring a bit more about their environment. We're at Swan Bay today. There's so many different treasures here. Lots of beautiful salt marsh, there's all the seagrass, and there's all the coastal plants. It's also one of our local Ramsar wetlands. Our Ramsar listed wetland is basically an area that's been identified of national significance for migratory bird species. They're important and they're special. My name's Rebecca St. Ledger. I'm the Environmental Projects Facilitator at the Bellarine Catchment Network. And my favourite migratory bird is the redneck stint. The redneck stint makes a really long migratory journey to Alaska, which is so unexpected for a bird of its size. And we're really lucky to have them here in Swan Bay. The redneck stint feeds here and then it migrates and does a couple of jumps along the way at Guam, North Korea, China, and then all the way up to the tundra in Alaska where it nests on the ground. So it relies on all those different locations to be looked after and protected for it to actually go through its whole life cycle. Ramsar wetlands are about protecting animals who don't just live in Australia, they live all over the world. So we have an international duty to take care of these species our Ramsar wetlands and our coastal areas, they're becoming more and more threatened with the build-up of people and there's such a small area of them and it's really important to protect them because even if they're not in your backyard, all of our environments are connected. Swan Bay is impacted by everything that can come through the catchment zones. So everything that we do on land and in the mountains and in our suburbs all eventually ends up affecting Swan Bay. At any age, people can help Swan Bay by taking part in some community events and learn how to protect some of the sites. You can get involved in a number of ways. There's lots and lots of different environmental community groups. There's environmental programs at schools. It's really important for everyone to appreciate these types of places like Ramsar Wetlands. Taking it in, learning about it will actually help you to look after it. No matter what age you are, this special habitat is here for all Victorians to come and discover.